let's start with uh, how this problem began. Uh, after eight years of Justin Trudeau's catch and release policies, we have more drugs and disorder, crime and chaos. Uh, Trudeau created the catch and release bail system. We called on him to repeal all of the catch and release bail policies that he brought in in the first place. Police officers nearly unanimously support that call. Uh, yesterday, uh, the government announced that it was going to reverse some of Trudeau's catch and release policies, but not all. We think they should go all the way, reverse the liberal catch and release system for bail and parole so that repeat violent offenders stay behind bars. It's just common sense and it will bring home safety to our people. As for our voting position, we'll, have a, we'll go through our caucus and our shadow cabinet to take a stand on it, but uh, I can appreciate that the, the police want any steps that can reverse Justin Trudeau's catch and release policies, uh, um, even if they don't go far enough. Well, to the leader of the opposition, the criminal justice system, the bail system, resolves down to silly, empty slogans. That's not how you create good bail policy. That's not how you create good criminal justice policy. And in addition, the direction he wants to go, I think, uh, completely eviscerates the charter right. Um, he would like to put everybody. Uh, from what he said, he would like he would like pretty much everyone to to be held in remand and, and not have bail. There is a charter. We're not going to. Uh, we have. We have. I'll say it honestly. We've struggled to stay within the charter on this, this this piece of legislation. We think we have, but going further than that would be very risky in terms of uh, in terms of violating the, the constitutional rights of Canadians.